Why did the turtle cross the road? Why not? <laughs> To get to the other side. Oh, okay. it's, it's an easy answer there. <laughs> now, you may see turtles on roadsides at this time of the year. The St. Louis Zoo and St. Louis University published a study on the effects of human activities on turtles. Researchers found that box turtles have significant chances of encountering roads. Females search for nesting sites in the springtime, sometimes along the roadways. So to help out, you can help move turtles crossing the road in the direction that they're facing. Leave turtles safe in the wild alone and increase green space when planting gardens and yards and outdoor spaces with native plants and, of course, native vegetation. Mm -hmm. So that, that's a pretty good idea. Mm -hmm. Now, I, I got a little story to tell. Oh. Moved here in 2004, and I'm looking out the window one afternoon, and I see a box turtle out there. I'm going, oh, that's kind of cool. Fast forward to a couple of days ago, the box turtle is still around. The what? same turtle how because do you know? it had a very distinctive pattern to its back. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's how I knew. And my dog saw it the other day. It started sniffing it. I mean, better watch out. Turtle turned around and. How oh. long can turtles li well, live? Well, there was a tortoise that was down in Chesterfield Valley at the Petropolis that I believe was close to 100 years old or you know 50 years old, something yeah. like that. They could live for. Well, to decades tortoises and decades. can, but tur well, box turtles? Still 20 years, still going. I don't believe that story. Uh, Keep an eye on that <laughs> Next guy. time I see that turtle, I'm going to snap a picture, and I'm going to get his ID. I don't believe it. He's a turtle liar. <laughs>